everybody, it's Darvini D here. And um, as you all know, I live in the tropics. So we like to have, even when it's cool out, we like to have fun, refreshing um, salads and things to eat. And pineapples grow here, avocados grow here. And in the winter, which is like now, we get all the other vegetables, like the broccoli grows here and the kale grows here and all those things. So today, I'm gonna make something really yummy. It is a broccoli pineapple salad with an avocado mayonnaise that does not have the eggs in it, all right? So this is super easy, super refreshing, and super fun. You can substitute um, mango or another tropical fruit for the pineapple. I used pineapple because it's what I had today. I always use what's in my cupboards or in my kitchen or in my fridge, and I always make the recipes that are under 20 minutes because we gotta make it fast for our families, right? And yummy. Okay, so here's what I did. This is broccoli. You just take raw broccoli, make it raw, and you put it through the food processor or you, and you chop it up very fine. Raw broccoli, pineapple, and uh, cranberries. And the avocado mayonnaise, I will do in a different video for you because it takes a little bit of time to do. Actually, it doesn't. It's really quick and easy. But that will be a different video, okay? So this has been in the fridge because you keep it in the fridge. So here what I'm going to do is I'm going to chop up a little fresh garlic, all right? I like the fresh garlic. Everyone likes fresh garlic. Oh, perfect. Okay, so chop fresh garlic, maybe a little bit more. Here we go. Okay, and voila. Now we're going to take the fresh garlic and we're going to put it, what I have in here, a little bit of broccoli, more of the broccoli florets when you take the broccoli apart. And I'm going to put some of the pineapple, so a little bit of the pineapple. So I like the pineapple on this side to be different sizes. And some of the garlic. Now this is going to like freshen it up and make it super kind of um, make it super kind of fresh and mixed up. Okay, here we go. Ready? One, two, three. Done. How is that? Let me fast, right? So now I'm going to mix that up in here with the broccoli florets. Right in here. That's the pineapple. I kind of got mixed up with the garlic. All right. Now I'm going to take the other pineapple that I have, the pieces of pineapple that I have, and I'm going to mix them here inside this. Ooh. Mm, I love the smell of pineapple because it's so sweet and refreshing. That uh, juxtaposed to the broccoli is so yum. Now if you have a food processor, it's a little bit easier than the Vitamix. The Vitamix kind of gets like a... But, um, Okay, so we're mixing this up, right? So again, this was the broccoli florets I did in the food processor or the broc or the um, Vitamix. Some fresh garlic and pineapple. I'm gonna add the cranberries. Some people add raisins again. I like the cranberries because they're tart or cherries. You can use cherries as well. And to this now, I'm going to add what is my mango mayonnaise. Really good, no eggs. It's really easy to make and really delicious. And um, I'm going to mix all that together right here. Look at that. And this is so healthy because you have, ooh, my mouth is watering. You have all the fresh avocado in there, the fresh broccoli, the garlic, the pineapple. And that makes for a really, really nice, refreshing salad. Broccoli salad to serve in the summertime or the heat. Now, it looks kind of funny, but it's really good when you taste it. And um, this is good for any side over anything. If you guys like veggie burgers, you can put that in that. If you like it with pasta, if you like raw pasta or zucchini pasta, or just as a nice raw broccoli, broccoli salad in the summer. Again, you can add mangoes, different things. And there it is. Yum. Okay, let me taste that. Oh my God, that's so good. Mm. <laughs> I'm so young. All right, bon appetit, have fun.